Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be giving you guys a review and a demo on the new Eco Styler Gel, the Black Caster and Flaxseed Oil Gel. And if you're interested in how I feel about this gel, just stay tuned. I wanted to show you guys the texture of the gel. As you can see, the gel is really, really, really thick, I'm guessing because of the flaxseed, but this is how the texture looks. So this is my hair after I've already applied the gel to my hair. I don't know why, but I feel like I have to use a lot of product in my hair for it to define my curls. And even though I did use a lot of product, it still didn't define my curls the way I want them to be. So, so this is so this is this side finished with the new Eco Style Gel, the Black Caster and Flaxseed Oil one. This one, and I'm gonna come back when I'm done with the other side and show you guys how my hair looks. So this is my hair 100% dry. As you can see, this is like more kind of a puffy kind of wash and go. It's not really that defined, and it's been a few hours later, and these are my results. Hi guys, I just wanted to come to you guys today to give you guys a review on the new Eco Styler Black Caster and Flaxseed Oil Gel. This is what it looks like. This is what it looks like. I know everybody's been talking about this gel or how good the gel is, so I just wanted to come to you guys to give you guys my review on this gel and how I feel about the gel and if I like the gel or not. So again, it's the Eco Styler Black Caster and Flaxseed Oil Gel. And it says it contains vitamin E, fiber, and omega-3. So the one that I got is, is it's the maximum hold, which is number, number 10. So I got the, the maximum hold for the gel. Because I like my hair to have a lot of hold. Okay, so what I can say about the gel is... I can say that the gel smells, the gel smells really good, and that's a plus for gel because everybody wants a gel that smells good. Gel is really thick, I'm guessing because of the flaxseed. These are my results for the gel. This is like, um, this is like four hours later from my hair. My hair is 100% dry. But what I can say about this gel is I feel like I have to use a whole bunch of gel, like extra gel for me to get the kind of hold that I need. Even though it's a number 10, I feel like it didn't really define my curls that much and it didn't really give me a really hold, a really strong hold like the other Eco Style gel. So the gel that I usually use is the the olive oil gel. And this is my like favorite Eco Style gel. It gives my hair a lot of hold and my hair actually lasts long with this gel. The castor oil gel, a flaxseed gel. This is how my hair came out and I don't really, I don't really like it because I feel like my hair isn't really defined. It's just like poofy, it didn't really do anything for my hair. So as far as this goes, I'm kind of disappointed in this gel because it didn't really do much for me of what it did look for in the gel. And this is what my hair looks like. So I feel like my hair is just puffy. So that's what I have to say about this gel. And I'm gonna also try out the coconut oil one and I'll let you guys know how I feel about that. So I really didn't like the way my wash and go came out so I actually just put it in a bun. And I forgot one more thing. If you use too much of this gel, it's gonna flake a lot. So I had like 
here have like a little a lot of i don't know if you can see but i have like a lot of white patches from the gel flaking from the flaxseed gel so this is a gel you can not use a lot of because with my the olive oil eco style gel i can use as much as i want and then my hair doesn't flake for this one you can't use a lot because it flakes a lot